Hello and welcome to another daily devotion from Hope Lutheran Church. Today is June 25th and it is the celebration of the presentation of the Augsburg Confession. So we're going to take, talk about that today. Uh, what is the Augsburg Confession? Well, it's uh, the statement of faith that was presented to the emperor by the Lutheran princes uh, in order to say, here is what we believe. It is no different than what the church has taught, that you can find all of these teachings in the church fathers. Nothing is new. This is not a uh, uh, some kind of new cult or uh, a deviation from the truth, but rather this is a, an attempt to reform the church to bring it back to what the Word of God teaches and what historically the church had always believed, taught, and confessed. Uh, so the Augsburg Confession is a statement of faith that the Lutheran princes were presenting to say, this is what we believe and we are willing even to die for it. Uh, now, at the heart of the Augsburg Confession is Article 4, which is on justification. This is what it really is all about. Everything uh, that flows from uh, justification, everything that follows flows from justification. Um, and and uh, if you get justification right, this is what I always tell my confirmation kids, if you get justification right, you have a chance to get the rest of the things right. If you get justification wrong, you will get everything else wrong in some way, shape, or form. It's like having the a foundation that is either good or bad. If you have a good foundation, you have a chance to have the whole house be good. If you have a, a faulty foundation, an uneven foundation, everything from that point forward is going to be skewed in some way, shape, or form. So here is what uh, Article 4 of the Augsburg Confession says. Our churches teach that people cannot be justified before God by their own strength, merits, or works. People are freely justified for Christ's sake, through faith, when they believe that they are received into favor and that their sins are forgiven for Christ's sake. By his death, Christ made satisfaction for our sins. God counts this faith for righteousness in his sight. So at the heart of everything is justification because at the heart of justification is Christ and his saving work. Uh, justification is how are you made right with God? Well, justification is presented very, very clearly here. It is by faith in Christ who has done everything necessary for your salvation. You don't add a thing to it. It is done. As Christ said on the cross, it is finished. So by faith in him, justification is yours. You are right with God right now by faith in Christ. Now, faith will never be alone. Faith will have good works that follow. And the Augsburg Confession says that. Faith is that which saves, not our good works. Our good works do not contribute even a tiny bit to our salvation. It is done entirely by Christ on the cross and his resurrection. And by faith in him, that saving work becomes ours. Uh, so rest secure today in the reality that in Christ, by faith in him, you are justified Salvation is yours. You are right with God, and the, the blessings of heaven are yours. Uh, God's blessings. Have a great day. I look forward to finally getting back to Genesis 32 or 34, whatever it was, uh, tomorrow, finishing up that chapter and uh, uh, concluding the week. Have a great day.